was actually studying Zen at the Zen Study Society in New York. Uh, we went together to Riverside Church. I think it was Hans Küng who gave a, a talk there. Right after the talk, it was announced that Martin Luther King had been assassinated, unfortunately. I was very sick at that time. I could not eat anything. And I learned about uh, Martin Luther King's death. There is a little bit of despair. There is a little bit of anger. A few months before, I met uh, Martin Luther King in Geneva during a peace conference. He stayed up on the 11th floor with his uh, team of workers. And uh, he invited me to come up uh, for breakfast. But I was caught in an interview, <laughs> you know. <laughs> so I uh, came up late. And he kept um, breakfast warm for me. <laughs> it was the last time we met. And I was able to tell him that uh, in Vietnam, those uh, of us who struggle for peace and human rights, we consider him to be a living bodhisattva. Mm -hmm. I was very pleased to, to hear that. I'm glad that I, I had the opportunity to tell him that before he died. What I have been doing since that time is just to build community. And we do it uh, for him <laughs> mm -hmm. also. That is why it's such a joy for me when I came last night to see that in some way you have uh, realized that dream in a way. I wonder if Martin Luther King's dream can ever be realized on a very wide scale. Maybe it's only small communities like Plum Village or a little monastery here and there. Martin Luther King spoke of uh, the beloved community because he was aware that without community you cannot do much. That is true in the case of the Buddha. A Buddha without a Sangha cannot do much. Martin Luther King knew that, so he spoke of the beloved community as a way to realize a dream, a Sangha, a community should have a harmony, brotherhood, sisterhood, the same ideal, and everyone should behave like a cell in the same body, no discrimination. With a Sangha like that, you can achieve uh, whatever dream you have. I think Martin Luther King knew that. He was very concerned about building the community.